What's up guys? Welcome back to our channel. Today we have another speed build for you and today's video is a part of the Sims Free Play series. So if you guys have no idea what I'm talking about, I'm going to explain for a second. There's an app called the Sims Free Play. It's like the Sims but on your phone. It's really great. You should go download it right now. I will wait. Did you do it? Okay, you're back. So there's this app called Sims Free Play and there's like default houses on the app just like there is in the real like Sims games on the computer. And I don't know why but I always just like building them on Sims 4. Like like rebuilding them onto the um, computer version. Uh, I think it's because I'm not the most creative person in the world. Uh, coming up with ideas from my own head are really hard. Um, that makes it sound like I'm not a creative person. Like I am because the last video uh, was a house that I completely did by myself but I think my biggest problem is is I reuse things too often because I get really set on stuff like if I think a certain window or a certain like couch is pretty like I'm gonna use it every single time like I have to kind of start like getting out of the mold of like everything being a family house because that's usually what I like building um so that's why I like kind of like recreating these because it just kind of lets me like try to find uh objects that are really similar to the one in the app so I kind of like can be like, oh, wow, this couch is actually kind of nice. Like, maybe I should use it more often. Like, just actually kind of look at the objects instead of just going to the same ones all the time. Hopefully that made sense. But anyways, um, I used to do that all the time. And then we started The Sims channel. So I was like, I should redo some of those. So today, I actually have built this once before. But I'm building it again. Um, this is like the OG version because, okay, the door is like on the side. I think that is stupid. So, um, on my phone, like on my app, I completely like renovated it and I like wanted to do my version and it's like, I'm doing air quotes. I wanted to do my version like really badly because I made like a little like foyer area and like the outside I made brick instead of like that awful yellow siding. But I know that like you guys know the default versions. So I made it exactly how the default default. Oh my gosh. I can't talk. I made it exactly how the default version is, um, or to the best of my ability, obviously. And um, these are getting a lot more fun too because like I'm getting more game packs because whenever I, I was like looking through the one I had like before, I like the one I built before I had this YouTube channel, and like it wasn't that great because I literally had base game and uh, get to work actually. That was my first expansion pack for Sims 4, which like get to work is good for like gameplay because it you, you literally get to go to work with your people but it comes with a lot of like work almost like industrial stuff like it comes with like I, I want to say there's like a surgeon like there's a surgeon um career path so it comes with like doctor stuff which like I'm never going to put in the house so like that kind of stuff like that like for building it wasn't very useful um but now we have all the expansion packs because there's only three so far and then we have spa day and like what's the one that came in the bundle it was like backyard stuff or something and like right now uh the game packs because there's the three tiers i always forget their names um the game packs are 25 percent off so we might buy a few more because the only thing is is like i feel like once i have all the game packs i should like redo these again just because like obviously the more things I have to choose from the more accurate it's gonna be but um anyways so let's talk about free play for a second this house on free play was um it was basically the introduction to basements because in free play like free play sucked at first basically all you could do was um plant that's pretty much it. You literally just plant it. Like people, even now when they watch me play Sims Free, like Sims Free Play on my phone, they'll be like, why are your Sims planting? And I have to explain like, oh, like that's how you get money. And they're like, well, why don't you just send them to work? And I'm like, I don't know. Cause like you send them to work and then like they're gone and like, it's just kind of boring and you can only do it once a day and like you need to make more money. Like it's like planting is really just not part of like 
the Sims experience on the computer. But um, as you guys, as I've like totally talked about before, they've added like career features where you actually go to work with them. But um, this was part of like, like them advancing their architecture. Um, I feel like I'm talking about like architecture and this is like freaking Sims. Like it's just the Sims. Um, that's how I feel like every time I talk about this, like me and Hannah will talk on the phone and we'll be like talking really seriously, but the subject of the conversation is Sims free play. And I'm like, we are adults and we are like having a really in-depth conversation about a free app made for like teenagers. <laughs> so, um, yeah. I feel like such a gamer though when I talk about Sims because like this is the only game I think I've ever gotten like into ever. Um, okay, but back to what I was saying. I was saying something else Sims. Oh yeah, architecture or whatever. So like there was just a lot like the thing about Sims free play is that you can only build as like a square if that makes sense. Like you can only build things in like a square like rooms. Like, see the hallway where it's, like, it's, like, two squares thick and then it gets to one square thick? Like, they do that by just putting, like, an archway in between. Like, everything has archways. That's how you get, like, L that's how you make L-shaped rooms and L-shaped hallways. You use the archways. Well, before, you couldn't make hallways one, like, block thick. Like, I'm using block as, like, you, okay, you, get, you get it, the square. Um, the grid lines. Yeah, um... You couldn't make it one square thick. And when they entered, I'm trying to think back because obviously I don't know like the history of Sims Replay, but they, in, when I introduced that, they made a new house called the Hallway House, which like maybe that'll be my next free play video. But um, this one introduced basements because they didn't have basements before. They had, they had multi-level though. Yeah, multi-level like sucked. It was like, a million dollars to make like to just like unlock or like build like a second floor um which I don't think that's the case anymore I don't think it's that much because I just remember like never being able to reach a million dollars where like now I'm like level 54 on sims free play um I, I was gonna say like I've I've had this sims free play game for almost three years because I've had Sims free play since like sophomore year of high school which is like five or six years ago but every time like I got a new phone or something I would just restart the game because I don't know I just did but whenever I got my iPhone 6 freshman year of college I was like you know what like I actually want to beat the game because like there's quests in the game and like the last one is called like Lives and Legacies and like I didn't really like know what that meant because it like would talk about like ages and stuff like that like I didn't get it um so I was like whatever like I'll like I'll actually try with the game this time so I actually ended up beating the game like quote-unquote beating the game like so I unlocked the last quest and then um I just kept going with it because like when you get a new phone you like upload it to the cloud like to your Facebook and then like you can like re-download it so, like, I re-downloaded it on this phone, and I've, like, kept going. And, like, my goal is to make it to level 100, but it's getting so hard, too. Like, I've been on level 54, I think, this entire year. And, like, I I play just about every day. And, like, I don't, like, even if it's just to, like, oh, like, collect my plants or, like, oh, just send, send people to work. Like, I play just about every day. Um... But yeah, it's, it's really tough to like, it's like getting tougher, especially too, cause like I don't keep a lot of people in my town because it's just a lot of people to manage. But like the way you level up is by like getting XP points and like you need more people, like the more people you have, the more points you're going to be getting at once and stuff. So yeah. Um, anyways, this is the basement. This is, um, me trying my best because like there was like luggage and boxes and stuff and I was like uh I'll use the presents from the free uh Christmas pack and then the pipes that those are like what I'm talking about when I say like industrial with the uh get to work stuff so I I put those there because there was like radiators in the sims free play one so if you guys want to download sims free play I'm gonna put it link below go check out this house and like 
I want you guys to like compare like how I do and stuff and like let me know if like I did a good job and whatnot. Um, so yeah, this is the end of the video. The screenshots are coming up in like 10 seconds. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love doing these free play houses. They're probably my favorite things to do. And I'm going to be so sad whenever I like finish them all. But whatever. Um, we also have a vlog channel, Hannah and I. Uh, the link to that will be below. You should subscribe to both channels. We really appreciate it when you do. And that is all. Thank you for watching. Goodbye, guys.